does it even grow down here? I don't know. Those big leaves could be useful. Like a dam. Dam what? No, it's... Never mind. Yes! It's just a plant plant, not a you plant. We ain't got much choice. What would you guys do without me? Yeah! Where, oh where, would we get another gun? Mora, let's climb up there. Get eyes on the problem. The problem is that Rocky needs to suck it up. Yeah, good luck with that. In Little Fuzzy's defense, he has died drowning in far less water than this. Exactly. Wait, what? This doesn't seem absurd to you? He's got a thing with water. What do you want me to do? You're supposed to be his leader. Have you met Rocket? Big beanstalk. The Almighty Star Lord. Say something? God, nope. Who's that? Who's I? I'm. Easy, Greenie. They'll figure it out. Rocket. Keep it up and I'll swipe them in your sleep. Missing Drax's anecdotes about the death. Like the Katathian equivalent of Jack and the Giant Beanstalk. percent interested. All right, I'm on it. Uh, it's actually kind of refreshing. Like a quick shower. What do you say, Rocket? I ain't ever showered either, and I ain't gonna start now. Hey, Buck. Times you see in a sty horror? Oh, it's too sad to count. I always have to stop around 50. Great! That's 10 apiece! Oh, no, 50,000, little fuzzy.
It grew. It's not that. I just want some help up here. If I jump, you can catch me, right? Guess we'll find out. That's not very reassuring. Just don't screw up the jump. <laughs> Anyway, thanks, Quill. Really. I was pretty sure you had tentacles. What do you say, Groot? Now that we got the whole team together? I am Groot. Absolutely. A dry rocket is a happy rocket. This is you happy? Oh, yes. You should see some of the dark versions of Little Fuzzy. Or maybe you shouldn't. This cramped corridor ring any bells, Mantis? Pretty sure this is the wet part. But what now? I thought we just did the wet part. Oh, it gets worse. <laughs> Everyone okay? I'd be seeing stars if I could see anything at all. Yeah, this ain't good. So, about all them futures where we die. Has he always been able to do that? He says he don't like showing off. Thanks, buddy. No, I don't gotta tell him. Oh, right. The thing. That you tell us in the dark. It's really important. No, it ain't. Shut up! Bottling up feelings is a time-honored tradition. If Rocket doesn't want to share... Boo! Don't be a Gamora. What's that supposed to mean? You know, someone who suppresses all their trauma. Drama, really? With water? Forget it, okay? Just forget it. So how long do we gotta wander around smashing our shins on rocks? Imagine it's a metaphor. You're in the physical darkness, and that reflects Green Meanie's mind. We can double back along Groot's path and then try to find the exit. Groot says stay close to him. At least you'll be able to see. It ain't a flashlight, Will. Remember back in the dark in the quarantine zone? I thought that was some funky energy thing. Funky energy in the dark. Groot's bioluminescence ain't exactly on the defined light spectrum. Anyone steps in water. Oh, that part's coming soon. Peter? 
I'm sure that it's not, but let's not tell Star Guy. He needs to learn for himself. I can hear you! Even better! We split it. Getting a little tipsy. That wasn't a sleepover. We were roughing it in the mountains while being stalked. Still, that was a fun night. I mean, the cactus juice did have unexpected but fun side effects. Anyone else getting really fed up with Little Miss Cryptic? Pretty? <laughs> Give me a break. At least it seems less dark through here, and less wet. Works for me. Mantis, anything in particular we should be looking out for? I'm trying to remember. I think this is where it gets loopy. Now it gets loopy? Oh, uh, there's that creepy fog again. I'm not even sure we're back with lead. It's always here. Always. Until it is. What's that supposed to- Shh. I don't- More Hellraisers. Wait, yeah. But it ain't those Flarknards. It's them creepy eyeball things from the QC. I'm definitely hearing Hellraisers. Then you ain't hearing right. It's eyeball things. I can't tell. Rocket's right. I don't know how it's possible, but I'll never forget that squidgy sound. It's the sound of wet eyeballs hitting the ground. Told you! It doesn't make any sense. You being wrong makes tons of sense to me! I have Good! Use that fear! Kill them all! Just killing party favors! It's tied in here! Watch your fire! Easier hey, look. said than done! Box clear. And there's a way out now. Weird. It's like this place has a mind of its own. Not mind. Force. Anyone else getting deja vu? It all looks the same with this fog. Well, it don't sound the same. It's them jelly things from Seknar. That explains Stumpy's stuff. No, it's Nova. I hear voices. How can you not tell the difference between monsters and people? Moore's right. I hear voices. Just like when I put on that helmet in the Nova base. You're both crazy. No flarking way. I heard no. It doesn't matter who's right. We can't trust what we hear. 
Sums it up. At least there's a way out now, I guess. Okay, now that's them bouncing eyeballs from the QC. No question. I'm not doing this. Something is clearly messing with us. Shitari? Okay, well, that's just wrong. You're worse than her. Those overgrown lizards make clicky sounds. You got moss in your ears. I'm with Groot. Shitari. I'll never forget those things as long as I live. This ain't no time to gloat. It's like you're more set. Something's messing with us. <laughs> Right. It can't be real. Sure felt real when we were fighting them. It's the fog. They're just sounds. I think those jelly things are gonna sneak up on us. I can hear them. This is like a maze with no exit! Definitely starting to feel like a rat. Can we actually hurt these things? Rocket! How do I keep guessing right? That's nine, keep your big mouth shut! Watch it! Spikes! Drop them up! How is it doing this? Not it. Us. This isn't right. It can't be real. Sure felt real when we were fighting them. It's the fog. They're just sounds. I definitely hear more of Hellbender's goons. Yeah, do your thing! I think maybe! You got this, boy! This is 
doing this not it us this isn't right it can't be real sure felt real when we were fighting them it doesn't make any sense but I can hear those squishy eyeball things from the quarantine zone They sound like all the flock and scut bags that have tried to kill us recently. Shh. What do you mean? Shh. Tell us right. Shh. And about what? Shh. There's a new way out. So it was nothing. I think it depends. It's got something to do with the freaky fog. Every time you name an enemy, it has the power to make that enemy appear. So the key all along was to keep quiet. Yeah, like that was ever gonna happen. I saw so many versions of us fucking so many different things, but the source? It's not done with us yet, Guardians. Yeah, well, let's just keep our eyes open and our mouths shut from now on. The fog entity has retreated for now. There's no immediate risk. Yeah, no offense, one lady, but nothing you say means anything anymore. So the fog is an entity now? Yes! Sort of. Ugh. what we're here for. Timeline, we all get smushed. Let me guess. Further down. Only if you want to save Drax and the whole galaxy. Let me get back to you. Okay, okay. Look, guys, um, <clears throat> I appreciate what you all did for me back there with the water thing. 
Um, but following the bug lady any deeper is officially stupid. Rocket. No. Fog monsters? Cave pigs? Wet waterfalls? Technically, all water... No! No, Quill. She doesn't know where we are. She doesn't know where we're going. She doesn't know what we're looking for. Mantis, are we hot or cold? Room temperature. Okay, okay. This is crazy. He is probably crazy. It's not about her. It's about us. I am so proud of us. Because we've never gone this far for anything before. Oh, this is the one where you inspire them. Just think about who we were when we started. Um, well, you were a two-bit broke pirate who couldn't even outrun a tree. Exactly! And you were a two-bit bounty hunter. Just as broke as me, just as depraved, self-centered, mindlessly chasing every unit, bar, contract, bank to rob. I still like many of those things. So do I! But none of those things are why we're here now, right? You're down here kicking ass for Drax. Not Drax the Destroyer, not Drax the Rampaging Criminal. Drax, man! Our friend. And Gamora. You've gone to the ends of the galaxy to hunt people, to hurt people. To get revenge in what I can only assume are some excruciatingly painful ways. But doesn't this feel kind of good? Going this far to help someone you care about? And Groot. Uh, he says you don't have to. No, no, I do. Because we all need to learn something from you, man. You never complain. But, or if you do, I don't catch it. But I, I, I'm pretty sure you probably definitely don't. You're always there for us. And that's what this is about. Us. Growing together as a team. Following a crazy lady into a death cave because one of us needs help. Because we are a team. Help, we're a family. We're the fucking guardians of the galaxy! Yay! Really great speech, Quill. Why didn't anyone stop me? You were on such a roll! It really was one of your better speeches. Playful now, Rocket! Them. Uh, us. Uh, them. The source is half destroyed. Little 
I know. Shut up, Quill! I know what I gotta do, and I I'm just gonna... Really? I'm gonna suck it up and do it! Be careful, You got this, <laughs> Please work! Come on, Rocky, you can do this! You can, right, Mantis? Mantis! Needed help. Bunch of them. Rocket, man. Yeah. Can we please just save Drax already? Warm. Very, very warm. I think she wants us to jump in the hole. I may not know what we're looking for, but I know it's down there. Okay, let's finish this, because I sure as flock didn't get all wet for nothing. Something saddens. Licking lingering wounds. Small fractured universe? Star guy ends up. It's the same one where he's your boyfriend. Ugh, I wish. I got a dud. You wouldn't believe how many duds there. Okay. Done with fog monsters. I think that depends on your definition. Ugh. Are more monsters going to come out of the fog and try to kill us? Hmm. That depends on your definition. Sure, you can't just tell us what to expect. Oh no, every time I do, this goes very, very badly. Trust me. We're here. Home of the healing light. Source of the cure. Origin of Raker's power. It's a cocoon? Told you she was gonna feed us to some giant bug. Or what? Oh, gross. Please tell me Drax is the only one who's got to go in that creepy egg sack. So the shepherds found fresh flock. <laughs> Foolish followers. Think fast, beard butt! You know not the gravity of your treacherous trespass! You cannot quell a god! Prepare for oblivion, interloper. Oh, what's this one? Okay, Green Meanie, you're up. 
found you. What wayward wickedness is this? Nasty uglies from that busted noggin of yours. It's okay, guys. It's him. Aaron Witchcraft. No. Wait. Aiden Warsock. Ashley Warsock. Adam Warlock? That's it! The Golden God guy! Hold on. This guy's Raker's old divine whatever? Looks pretty good for a dead guy. Were you not sent by the sanctimonious shepherd? Us? With Raker? Not a chance. We're trying to shut his ass down. See? Friends. Okay, big guy. And we go. Come on! All the ones where we die already happened. <sighs> Raker's got half the galaxy going cuckoo bananas, her friend included. I swapped your ass for a newer, younger, blue-skinned model. So, can you help us? Mantis seems to think you can cure Drax. My heavenly healing is veiled malignance. A first folly I swore never to repeat. <sighs> can someone translate this guy? He said no. What protection I can proffer is to remain reclusive. Not this time, Goldie. The pieces need to go back together. We just gotta get you all closer to the puzzle. And that would be... In here, of course. Whoa, wait, let, let's talk about... Th what the butt? It's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. Welcome to the Astral Plains, Snorlord. You teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your minds. Merged our what? 